Hi there, this is Jean Roman with For Dragonflies and Me. I am super excited to be here today sharing a new recipe that I'm gonna make for you, and it is called a jalapeno popper sourdough sandwich with Swiss and turkey bacon. Um, you can also switch it up with Canadian bacon. So today I'm gonna to put this together for you, and what we're gonna do first is I'm going to show you um, how I make my cream cheese spread with fresh minced garlic and some Parmesan cheese. So super yummy. So here we go with that. So I have a cup of whipped cream cheese. So what I'm gonna do with that, I'm gonna move some of this stuff over and I'm gonna take one of these garlic cloves I've already got taken apart. And what I'm gonna do is mince this garlic, one clove in it. So super easy. I love my Pampered Chef garlic press. If you like it a little more garlicky, you can feel free to add more garlic. Um, I always say, can't get enough garlic, but I know you can. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a quarter cup of fresh grated Parmesan cheese. I'm gonna add that into there. Put that to the side. And then what I do is I blend this super yum. This, just for future reference, is super good with breadsticks. It's an incredibly easy recipe and um, it just makes such a delicious spread. So there's that all set. So we're gonna put that aside. And then I have some delicious sour, sourdough bread that I picked up from Panera, uh, super good. And with that, I'm going to take some of my butter that I have already put, it, put aside and probably like I'd say a good tablespoon on each slice. And this is going to help your bread not stick to the frying pan. So here we go with that. Spread fairly evenly. I'm gonna take another tablespoon, half a tablespoon, depending on how big your bread is. Uh, this loaf of bread was actually pretty small. Some sourdough bread can get really big. So there that is. We're gonna set this off to the side. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take my first piece of bread and I'm going to slather it with some of this delicious cream cheese. And then I'm going to take a slice of my baby Swiss cheese and put that on there. So let's try the Canadian bacon first. So two pieces should be good. I'm gonna put that there. And then I'm going to take some jalapenos and I'm going to thinly slice them. And I'm gonna slice six slices. And then I'm gonna place them on there and you can use canned jalapenos. Um, I love fresh jalapenos. I think fresh jalapenos are the bomb. And so after that, I'm gonna put down another slice of Swiss cheese, because can you really have too much cheese? I don't think you can. But this is also going to help the jalapenos not fall out after it's grilled. Place that down there, and then you can put a little bit more of your cream cheese spread on there. Again, can you have too much cheese? There we go. And then we're gonna put that on there. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take this sandwich and I'm going to put it in a frying pan and I'm gonna grill it uh, probably about a minute and a half on each side and pressing it down so that it um, melts nicely. And then afterwards, we are gonna have this delicious sandwich. This is the first one I made and this one has turkey bacon in it. So as you can see, nicely toasted on both sides. The cheese is nicely melted. And let's cut this baby open. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. And yum. So here you go. Super easy, super yummy. And to see this complete recipe, you can also go to my blog. And the ingredients and description is going to be in the bottom description of this YouTube video. But thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't visited me at my blog, please go there at www.fordragonfliesandme.com. And also please follow me on Facebook and Instagram. And of course, 
If you got value out of this recipe, please subscribe and follow me here at YouTube. I love your feedback, so be sure to put some comments down below. Until next time, dragonfly friends, happy day.